Welcome. Today I'll be showing you how to teleport and use notice. As I said in the other video, I'll be showing you how to teleport. So, first we'll just go through combat. As an aimbot, it aims at people. It aims at mobs or players. You can change it when you click U. You type in aimbot. It says user, or you can aim at a specific player. You can cycle through the modes by taking cycle. You could just change mode and then both. And then hook the aimbot at mobs and players. So that's one good thing. And the next one is aimbot attack. So it, it attacks the player. So aimbot it just points right there. But if you add attack to it, it'll start hitting them once they get into range. So it's like force field though. But it's similar to force field. It's really annoying, it's not that useful. Aimbot isn't that useful. Yeah, and, then, and the next one is bow aimbot. Well, basically all it does is points the, the, the arrow key to any player or mob you can choose. It'll point there, but it won't be effective because it'll be pointing at the, pl at the player or mob. It won't be aiming at it like... Some bows, all bows have arches, so it arches over. It won't just go straight, so you, it's really not useful. And click aimbot, it aimbots at the player, and then you click. So same thing as aimbot. And force field is my, f is my favorite. So, this will take turn bow aimbot off. And so yeah, how you control, how you turn, move this around, is by using the arrow keys. So force field, I'll show you, it just hits everything in a certain area, even behind you, so I'll be killing this mob from the back, so I start hitting it, and stuff, and then bats, it'll just automatically hit wherever it is. So it'll just be attacking a bunch of mobs at the time. Yeah, that's about force field. Oh, see, I, didn't, I wasn't even looking at the bat, and I still killed it. So world, it just has a bunch of them. So radar, it just shows you the any players around. There's X-ray, it shows all these blocks. Also, you can see the diamond doors. There are also some hotkeys for them. You just kind of have to find them out. So X-ray is X, and like R is fly. I don't know why R is fly, but it is. And there's a bunch of them like that. So X-ray is really useful. So there's water walking. So you can walk on water. World you can just explore by yourself because it just affects you, not anything else. Player, it's auto fish. There's a lot of auto in player. So auto mine, auto and stuff like that. But it's auto tool, so it'll switch to, it'll switch tools automatically. So I'm mining cobble and then if I have a shovel. So, even with notice, you can get a lot of stuff really easily. So, auto tool, I click that, it'll turn into pickaxe. If I click that, it'll turn into dirt. So, it's really useful if you're like excavating. So, like, you're just mining constantly and you you don't want to change or take out your shovel when you hit gravel. It's kind of annoying when that happens. Okay, and fly doesn't really work unless the server is vanilla with no with no plugins or anything. Or any, no plugins. See, look, it just changed into the sword when I hit it. So this is pretty good. Everything automatic derp. It'll just you'll be doing random stuff. You can also change it when you type in derp on here, like the mode. Well, but you can't see it yourself when you do F5. You won't be able to see anything. <laughs> the only other players can see what you're doing. And free cam is pretty good. You can just check other people out even with your phone. So it's not that is it. That's the real you. You're not. You're not. So all you're doing is being a different player with creative mode, and you can fly around and see everything. But you know 
how am I breaking these blocks, it won't be affected in the real game. So, so it won't be affected in the real game. Also, you can use fly and just fly around, go inside blocks. So it's really good for finding bases and like seeing what they're doing. All these stuff is really useful. Okay, just need to take that off and then I'll just go back to there. So that's pretty much it. And then that's pretty much it. But uh, now I'll be showing you how to teleport. I'll be right back. Welcome back, guys. I just changed servers to somewhere where I can find a base. So I found this base. It's pretty torn up. And so you can teleport up and down. You must notice. A lot of people don't know about this, but when you click U and type in B clip, there's this thing that comes out that says teleport up amount of blocks, teleport down amount of blocks. So I'll be showing you how to do that. So I'm up in the server, I'm just showing you how to do it. And I really don't need this donor stuff or anything, I'm just showing you. Okay. So let's just say well as you can see on the bottom is the donor shop. So you can type in new well well before you do that. You can use free cam to check exactly how many blocks are in there. Are like from you. It has to be a good exact number of blocks. So you really can't use it on half blocks or anything. Well, I actually never tried, but so first you need to oh use free cam to fly. You can just go down. So count this as one block. One, two, three, four. So then. Press U, type in B clip. And then if you're going down, you do negative. If you're going up, you do positive. So I'm going negative, you do negative four. And then now you're in the donor shop. Usually it doesn't work once you teleport up or down. So like, oh fuck, I'm off. Well, you can use this stuff like this. This is just an example. Also teleport up. Let me show you that too. V clip positive five. V clip positive five. So now I'm up on the roof. It's really good for raiding bases from the AFK. It's perfect. You all do that stuff. I'll be showing you how to raid bases too. So I'll, I'll go to my base. This is my faction home. Well, just ignore that. I'm going. Well, I'm going to be teleporting up. I covered this place with a crafting table so people can't enter pearl in. So, all you need to do is do what I did before. You can go to player and then you use free cam and fly. So, you just count how many blocks there are. So, there's one. So I can use it to go down. Negative five, or negative six, and I'm done here. It works. It's really good for rating. Yeah, and I'll be making more videos on Notice. I hope you guys check it out. Bye.